So the upcoming Joint Potential Positive Future weekend is coming up, which is the 11th to the 13th of May, and it's taking place up in Aberdeen. And um, because of that, I promised a friend that I would do a quick blog about um, my time at Joint Potential and, and things that I've done. So I can't really go. I've been to quite a few weekends, and they're all amazing. So I'm going to talk today about the Positive Future one that I've been on before. It's one that um, really stuck in my mind. Uh, we done a, an exercise, a workshop, um, about being assertive. And at the time, I really wasn't very assertive. It, this was back in 2010. It was the third weekend I'd been on. And um, I had an appointment, my first appointment, for my doctor's well, my consultant. Um, I wasn't really looking forward to it. I've never been very good at talking to doctors or saying I have all this I get all ready for it and I have all this stuff in my mind but then when I get there I go really blank and I start um, shaking and crying and nothing comes out the way I want so this exercise was really useful for me um, it showed me that I was an assertive person but only in certain aspects of my life we had them um, to fill out all these different bits and pieces and various scenarios it was really really interesting and it taught me a lot about myself, it really did. And I took what I'd learned from there and I started putting it um, into a journal, which is this thing right here. So I, I haven't really shown anyone this, it's private, but I put everything in here and I started it just after doing the assertive workshop. Um, I just wanted to, to let people know that the very first time I ever went to Joint Potential Weekend, I was so nervous. Um, I'd never met anybody that was my age before that had the same thing as me or anything similar. Um, I didn't even know that they existed. So I just remember getting on, on the bus to go and I got to Glasgow and it was pouring rain and it was freezing cold and I was so nervous. I ended up sitting outside the bus station for an hour trying to decide whether or not I actually wanted to go and eventually I, I did wander along and I got there and within the first kind of 15 minutes I had like a massive mental breakdown I was just emotional I was all over the place I decided I wanted to go home and one of the women there um, took me to one side and kind of just took me out of the out of the equation kind of sat me down and gave me a glass of water and I kind of thought about it and I stayed and it is the best decision I ever made. I urge anybody, any young person between 16 and 25, if you have never met anyone close to your age before, this is a place to be, joint potential. The people there are, they're just, they're young, they're interesting, they're normal. And I don't think I've ever felt more normal with a bunch of people than I have ever felt with them. They really have been a massive lifeline for me and all the workshops and the information and just just meeting people and talking. Um, it doesn't even have to be about your arthritis. I mean, we talk about everything and anything. Um, there's people from all different walks of life and it's one of the best experiences I've ever had. And the positive from that is that I've managed to take a lot from it, which I didn't think that I would be able to, um, but I did. So I urge anybody to go. And I found out as well that there's only a few places left. So if you want to go, get in touch. Um, all the information's on the Connect Scotland website. So you should definitely have a look. Um, Joint Potential, Positive Futures, Aberdeen. I cannot wait. It's going to be so much fun. So much fun. So um, take care until then. And everybody who is going to Joint Potential, I will see you all very, very soon. Take care. Bye.